guys, it's Abby and I am back and this is the day. We are opening 100 gacha capsules and I have to say a big thank you to Bai for sponsoring this video. I would not be able to do this without them. Look at my babies. There are so many of them. And like I said, I was able to purchase these thanks to Bai and so can you. Bai is a forwarding service and a shopping service. I actually didn't know this, but they have a auction support service where they can help you bid and purchase items off of Japanese auctions. So that's really good if you're looking for older items that may not be in shops. Anyway, you should definitely check out their site. I'm gonna leave some links down below to my favorite gacha sets and some of my favorite gacha shops. And another big thank you to them. This here is my dream video. Anyway, without further ado, let's get started. Let's start with this one. I did try to peel a lot of the tape off beforehand, but we'll see. This is called the Pokemon Figurip. Fig Figurip. It's a clip, I think. Here is Pikachu, and it looks like a little figure, but is actually, let me see if I can do this right, a clip, look at that. He kind of looks like he's dancing. Here he is grabbing onto the paper. That's pretty cute. Probably can't grab too much, but it'll be good for journaling. Little cute journal pal. Next one, this one. Oh, this one's an easy open, no tape. And, oh, it looks like we have a Halloween one. Move aside, Pikachu. We have a Halloween beware, is that his name? Next one, ooh, what is this? Open for me, oh, there's another latch. There we go. What is this? Oh, it's a little car? What is this from? Oh, it's from a sushi shop. A lot of sushi places and some restaurants have gotchas for kids. I think I won this. They were doing a campaign, I think, where you could win a gotcha medal. Pretty sure that's what that is. I think it was supposed to come with stickers, but I don't see any. Has a cute face anyway. That was weird. Let's move on. Oh, it's a Disney one. Oh, I know what this one is. It's one of the new figure collections. The series itself is called Kore Kara, like collect character, I'm assuming. And they're just little cute figures. They kind of remind me of the Lego series, the Lego mini figures. They're not really posable or anything. Her arms do move though, and it says Daisy Duck here on the bottom, so you don't get confused. Who's who? Super cute. I think we're gonna be seeing some more of those because I did buy full sets of some things. What is this? Oh, it's fairy tale. It's Lucy. I get so many requests for fairy tale gotchas, but fairy tale isn't that popular here. I would say that One Piece is a lot more popular, and I know a lot of people compare those two animes. I personally love both. But anyway, it looks like I did find a fairy tale gotcha. I think this was a very long time ago. How about we grab this guy? It's a big gotcha. Make some room here on the table. Ooh, Splatoon. This is cute. It's an acrylic charm, and I think Mr. Panda will like this. He is still obsessed with Splatoon. Let's grab this guy. I think it might be something Pokemon. Oh, this is one of the sets that I got. Move aside there. Here we have the Maenarae Machi. It's actually a set of Pokemon that kind of march in a row, and here's the first one. It's Eevee. Next, let's go for this one. Oh, it's a miniature. It's a bottle of detergent. And look it, it has like shaky stuff inside. I always love me a good miniature. This seems like good Nendoroid size. I think this is another acrylic charm. Let's open it up. Oh, it's Kingdom Hearts. I kind of remember getting this. It is Sora, Donald, and Goofy in their Halloween Town outfits. Here we go. Oh, what is? this. Oh, Pokemon. I said that weird. Pokemon. Pokemon. It's a Butterfree. It's just a little figure. I think this is a series where they're all holding flowers. Don't quote me on that. What is... Oh, it's the cat miniature series. Nyanko Kitchen. It's the new breakfast series. Here is the kitty cat pancake set. Here we have a bottle of chocolate syrup. I would prefer maple syrup, but that's okay. A little bit of whipped cream and a scoop of chocolate ice cream, maybe? A little paw cookie. So this is more of like a dessert pancake. A little fork and knife. That doesn't quite look like a knife. I think there's some more of those in here. Got one, it's on the edge here. Right where I could see it. A little teapot and look at this guys. It pours out 
milk. I don't know what that is. A little bit of soup in a cup and the little croutons, I'm assuming that's what they are, are cat shaped. A box of soup and a spoon. You know what? I think I'm gonna try to pull out the full set of those because I think they'd look really cute all together. Except, I don't think I can find them all right now. Let me open these two anyway. This one looks like a waffle iron. And this one looks like a pot of some sort for cooking maybe. Here's the waffle iron. Here, pancakes, scoot aside. We have a new star. And this one opens up. That is so cute, it's cat shaped. Oh wait, it's actually called a toast set. I've never seen a toaster like that, but okay. If it's gonna make me cat shaped toast, I'm okay with anything. Some tongs because your toast is gonna be hot and a little plate for your toast to go on. Here is the pot that I think is supposed to be a fry pan. Sorry, it's not looking cute anymore. We gave up on that. I thought this was rice, but it says it is scrambled eggs. And look at that, you can have a side with ketchup or you could have a side with parsley. That's cool. And did you guys notice? That's exactly the sound my scrambled eggs make when I cook them. And a little plate that says Nyanko Kitchen. And of course you have to cook your eggs with a spatula, flip them over and dish them up. Wait, this is so much fun. Why am I having so much fun right now, guys? So there are two more sets. I don't know where they are in here. I, I'm not gonna look for them. It's a waste of time. Let's just keep opening. Let's open this one. This one does not want to open. Oh, I know why. It's because it's a stubborn little Shiba Inu in here. So of course the capsule's stubborn too. We have stubborn, reluctant Shiba here. So it is a strap and it's meant to look like he's not wanting to go with you. And my dog does this very often, especially when we go out for a walk and she does not want to go home. She makes this exact face. Let me know if your dog does this. Let's grab this capsule. Looks like it is Pokemon something. I kind of wish you couldn't see into the capsules to make it like even more a surprise, but I get that people want like certain ones. So they want to be able to see which one it is right away. Pippi! So this is Clefairy, right? The English and Japanese names, I'm never gonna learn them all. This is a fairly new set. It is the color palette set, I think it's called. And this is the pink set. And I'm hoping they're gonna come out with other colors. Stand right there. I'll see if I can find you a friend. I know I ordered a full set of these. Here's one. Let's open this up, maybe. And we have Mew. Mew has a tube of paint that is the exact same color. Oh, hey, look, I found the stickers on with the sushi car. No wonder I couldn't find them, they were buried. Let's open this one. It is Pochako. This is very adorable. It is Pochako standing with a butterfly on his tail. I wonder what kind of dog Pochako is supposed to be. There are a lot of dog characters in Sanrio. Pom Pom Pudding, Cinema Roll. Is this Spotty Dotty Sanrio? I see something that I think Mr. Panda would like. You guys can probably guess what it is. It is a golden poop. Um, it is an unhappy golden poop and a plunger. How cute, I didn't know he had a little face. And also kind of funny that he's unhappy. Let's go for this one. I don't really know what's what anymore. We just, we just gotta get through this together, guys. There is a lot going on here. Oh, it's Chip. Move aside, golden poo. Chip is here. And Chip does not want to go on his stand. Oh, come on, Chip. There we go. Oh wait, the head kind of moves a little. Look at that. Oh, it's slightly poseable. Pretty cute. Now we just have to find Dale. Hopefully he'll show up later. Let's open this one. Is there tape on this? Yes, there is. I remember getting this one last week. It was actually in my gotcha hunt video, which you should have watched before you watched this because it's kind of the prequel. Here it is. It is a little bottle with beads in it to look like foam or like, you know, the fizzy part. I kind of don't appreciate how they want me to put the label on myself, but let's see what I can do. I think I got it. A round of applause, please. Let's go for, I mean, let's get rid of the big ones, huh? That will make it look like less. I make it sound like this is like awful, but I'm having fun. 
I really am, guys. I would be having even more fun if I could open this. There we go. Oh, it's another Kingdom Hearts acrylic charm. Da -da! This one is really cool. I love this. I do wish Donald was like the main part of this, but you know, that's just me. But for real, the art is really cool. Let me know who your favorite Kingdom Hearts character is. Mine, probably Aqua. I love Aqua so much. That was really heavy. Oh, I think this is one of those gotcha ones. These are such a pain to put together. We're gonna leave that one for now. Let's grab this one. I want an easy one. <laughs> the tape was yellowing on that one, must be old. It's a dessert bunny. Looks like it's a little figure. Let me see if I can figure this out. I think the bunny, there we go. The bunny holds a spoon and the spoon rests on the whipped cream. That's really cute. I definitely like the figures more than the straps. Oh, Pikachu. Wait, is this a double? We got our first double, guys. It's the Pikachu clip. But this time he doesn't have a spot on his head. He has a spot on the back of his head. Very important little detail there. Let's grab this one. You know it's fine when the tape just peels off, but when it's all sticky and gunky like this, it just... It just frustrates me so much. Can you tell I've had a lot of coffee today? I thought I needed to be energized for this video. Oh, hello? Got it! Oh, I remember this one. It's kind of weird. It is a set of animals dressed up as other animals. So it is a bulldog dressed as a golden retriever. Which is kind of cute, but also weird. Does this dog wear the dog head? Oh wait, I think I got it. I don't know how I feel about this one. I'm a little creeped out, I will be honest. Let's open this one. I have been eyeing this one for a while now. See, that tape came off easily. Ooh, it's a drink. Is this one of those slime ones? I believe it's supposed to be like a matcha shake or matcha frappuccino. It doesn't open or anything, but it is a very cute keychain. A little bit on the heavy side. I'm assuming this is silicone in here, very dense. It says, happy best goods. Let's open this mystery one here. I have no clue what is in here. Oh, it's my uh, flower pot city. I remember getting this in the gotcha hunt. Looks like I got Egypt. Pretty cool. Whoever came up with this concept, I love the design. This is one of the Kanahe gotchas, and I think it's pretty old. And this is definitely not the one that I wanted. Look at all these cuties. Pikachu, Dedenne, Rowlet, and then some weirdos. I don't even know this guy's name. And no offense if this is your favorite Pokemon, I don't mean that in a rude way. Well, actually that was kind of rude, but I mean, would, is that the one that you would really want from this set? Really? It's another of the Disney figures. It's Goofy. I've been wanting to have a movie night to sit down and watch the Goofy movie because I have not seen it in years. Okay, these are growing on me. They're really cute. Here's Chip and Daisy so far. Next one. If I can open it. There we go. Oh, it's one of the Sanrio clips. I think I told you guys about my obsession with clips like this. I like using them as journal clips, except this one is kind of not easy to use. There we go. Yay for cinema roll. I should have been counting as I opened, huh? Here is a, ooh, this one's pretty. I absolutely love the Kingdom Hearts mural stained glass. Okay, now this one's my favorite one. You know what, I think it's time. I think we're gonna put together this miniature gotcha. I just have to see which character it is. Okay, it's a Pokemon one, and it's the red and yellow. Oh, it's Pikachu! There's the machine. Here are the stickers, some more stickers, some more stickers, the acrylic piece that goes on top, stand, sign. I'll be right back. Here it is, it only took me, you know, a lot of time. I kinda have to turn it sideways so you can see the whole thing because I don't want to move my camera. I did see one of you guys asking if it actually works and it does. Moving on, let's open this one. I'm not sure what this is. I've been eyeing it since this video started. It kind of looks like a miniature suitcase, but I don't think it is. Oh, it's a toaster. Are you guys ready for this? It is toast that says, have a nice day. And this one says, good morning. And okay, we push it down and 
Pop goes the weasel. Actually very satisfying. I could do this all day. I need a break, guys. Have we even gotten halfway yet? How lucky am I to be able to complain about having to open too many gotchas? This one's cute. It's Pochaco, and the birds sit on his head. I approve. I too would like birds to sit on my head. Actually, probably not because they'd probably poop. Speaking of poop, here we have a silver poop. Does this one have a face? Yep. Oh, this one's not very happy either. I guess poops wouldn't really have too much to be happy about. I see at least two more miniature gotchas and I'm going to pretend I didn't. Let's open this one because I have no clue what's in it. I bet it's another potted city. I was right. Looks like Hogwarts. It is. Drum roll please. Denmark. Copenhagen. Let's open another big capsule. Oh, it's the Let's Go Eevee figure that I got in the gotcha hunt. I think this one perches like on the edge of your cup and stuff. Look at Eevee can perch on Denmark. Here's a really chunky one. Not quite sure what it is. It's, oh, I know what it is. It's the rice cooker and it looks really realistic. How do I open it? it has a little pot on the inside. I really like this. There's dog hair on this one, which means it's probably old. Oh, it's mini. Move aside, rice cooker. Here we have mini. It's from the Pickledies series and means her tongue sticking out is pretty much what it means, Pickledy. And she would look really cute if there was a little Mickey to go right next to her. Oh, look, it's the cat breakfast. I think this is the bread set. Here it is, a bowl of dough, a rolling pin, dough to roll out, unbaked bread, and baked bread. They really think of everything. I think it's time to break for lunch. I'm gonna be back in a second. All right, guys, I had some lunch and I am back. Let's continue opening these guys. I think this is the bread one. Here it is, and this is a real bread. Well, this isn't real, but it's modeled after a real bread that they actually sell. And I've never eaten this one. I love how it comes with the little bread tie thingy. What, what is this officially called? Does it have a name? I've been seeing this Chitan sitting here for a while now. And do you guys know Chitan? She is a mascot. I think she's from Akihabara. Here she is. It's another cup percher. She is a baby fairy otter. I don't know. Like, I don't know the whole background story, but... If you don't know who she is, look her up. She is crazy and very popular. I remember getting these because I remember I got like six dittos and it's like a set of nine different clips. There are four different Pikachus and I got like six dittos and I'm not like exaggerating. It's a cute clip so I have no complaints. I just don't need six. How about we open another Kingdom Hearts acrylic charm? I'm really liking this series. I was thinking that I would get the set and then give some away to my friends that like Kingdom Hearts, but it's Donald! Um, I've literally loved every single one. Well, I'm obviously keeping this one. Here is Donald, my favorite duck in the world. How about this one? I don't know what it is. It's Rockruff. It's a Pokemon one. I think it's the flower series. Look at him. He's a good boy. He has a flower in his mouth. And he's holding some flowers. I'm assuming this came out for spring. Let's open this. Looks like it's another poop, but it's a purple poop with a bucket. Now the real question is, is this poop happy? Look at that, the purple poop is happy. Does the purple poop sit on the bucket? It can. Let's open this one. Oh no, I almost broke my fingernail. Oh, wait, what? Is this a triple? What's going on? Another Pikachu. I would really love to get Eevee. I didn't think I'd be getting triples in this video. Anyway, here is a cute little bunny. It's the same Spoon Bunny series, but it is on a strap. Let's open this guy. I can already kind of tell what it is. It is another double. You know what? I was just talking about triples luck. What is it when you have six? Four is quadruple. I don't know, but whatever six times luck is. It's another ditto. I'm just gonna leave him in the bag. I will give this to a friend. Let's see what this guy is. It looks like an anime figure of some sort. 
Is it? Oh, it's another fairy tale. Don't remember getting these. Must have been a very, very long time ago. Oh, it's Natsu. This is cute. He has his fairy tale mark. His hair seems a little pastel, but you know what? I'll take it. He's wearing a scarf. Let's open this one next. Oh, it's the Donald figure. Did him. Okay, this is adorable. Look at, he's like a little bobblehead. I see a Pokemon in there. It's Squirtle. Oh, so I don't know. I must have gotten a bunch of these. I love water Pokemon. I watched uh, Detective Pikachu and I fell in love with Psyduck. What is, oh, this is another Kingdom Hearts one. It's not an acrylic charm though. This is the one that I got in the Gotcha Hunt video. Here it is. It is a matte sticker, I think. All the keyblades. Can you name them all, guys? If you can, I'll be super impressed because I can't. And it's a mirror, so that's fun. I'll probably put this in my purse. Just cute to have on there when you need it for little touch-ups. Looks like we have a, another Pokemon color palette figure. It is Jigglypuff, or as we call them, Pudding. Let's open this guy up. I think this is another aquarium charm from Osaka, Lope. And Usagi, I think that was just called. And this is Akira Senpai. And he is, looks like figure skating with a penguin. I don't know what he's doing. Let's open this guy up. I can't see through the plastic. Oh. Charmander. Wait, I have a ton of these. I wouldn't have triples though if I got a full set, right? This does not make sense. It's another Clippy. Next one. Another Pochaco. Da -ding. I think it's, oh, is he supposed to be laying on his back or is he supposed to be sitting? No, I think he's supposed to be laying on his back. Let's open this one up. Looks like there are some shoes in here. Looks like a pair of sneakers. These are so cool. It's just a pair of sneakers on a keychain but they seem to be really well made. The laces and stuff have a lot of detail and I really like how they look. I actually like this style sneaker a lot. Let's open this one. Is a, why can't I think of the English name? In Japanese, this is Lucky. I really can't think of the English name. You guys are gonna have to remind me. I think I'm gonna have to bite the bullet soon and open the miniature gotchas, <laughs> but I really don't want to. Maybe I'll just build them both at the end. Here we have another Kingdom Hearts acrylic charm. This time it is Goofy. Looking pretty cool there. Here is a Chiton metal keychain. Pretty cute. Looks like it's a photo of Chiton that they printed on a metal tag. Here's one that Mr. Panda picked. He's not here because he's at work. I'm gonna open it for him. He said he wanted the black one. Looks like he got, no, is that? I think that's like a really deep green. Never mind. So this is a Suzuki Jimny. He doesn't necessarily like off-road cars like this, but for some reason he wanted this gotcha. I find it best if we don't ask questions. Let's open this. What is in the capsule? Whoa, oh, oh, it is Charmander from the Mayanarae, the little marching set. Can we please talk about his little teeth? Very adorable. Here we have a pochaco, oh wait. This one's cute. Don't get me wrong, they're all cute, but this one's especially cute. Look at Pochaco with his, I'm gonna call it a Walkman because that's what it looks like it is. I'm so excited the old school characters are getting more love. Who's your favorite Sanrio character? Mine growing up was My Melody. Before that it was Hello Kitty, I think. But currently, I mean, I love Red Skull. I love Humming Mint and I love Mopu. You know, the lazy character and the angry character. It is Evie from the Let's Go Evie, Let's Go Pikachu set. Here is Evie. I do really like that you can dress up Evie. And wait, the flower is a girl, right? When it's a flower tail, when it's a star tail, it's a boy. Why do I have so many Pokemon gotchas? I feel like me being me, I should have more Disney ones, but I think they're just making a lot more Pokemon stuff now. Is this a Pikachu butt clip? I love Donald Duck butt because it's floofy. The Pikachu butt's pretty adorable too. Another one that I should know the name, like I should know all the generation one Pokemon names in English, but I don't. Wait, I think I got it, it's Slowpoke, right? In Japanese it's Yadong. And he's just, you know, chilling on a tube of paint. Looks like another acrylic charm. Oh, it's Sora. I love Birth by Sleep, but I think Kingdom Hearts 2 will always be my favorite. Let's open this. We have, oop, 
Pluto. Who are we still missing? I'm going to assume just Mickey because we have Donald, Daisy, Minnie, Goofy, Chip, and Dale, and Pluto. So we may just be looking for one more. Oh, it's Snorlax in the little Clippy figure. Do, 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 do. So I have Snorlax, Squirtle, Charmander, and three Pikachus. And I'm missing Eevee and Bulbasaur? I think that was the rest of them. Let's look and see who we have in here. Oh, it's another spoon bunny. Hold your spoon. I'm gonna set the spoon on the chocolate. Adorable. How about we open this big one here? There are a lot in this set. How many total? Eight. King Mickey. I love King Mickey. Oh, I do have the AV clip. I don't know what's going on. Maybe I did get a full set and I forgot that I got a full set and got a few more. We'll see if Bulbasaur shows up at some point. So there's the Eevee clip. These are not really easy to use as clips though. Oh, there we go. It's a little better. Let's see, let's open this one. I see like a face peeking through and I have no clue what this is. I'm very curious. Here we go. Okay, wait, hold on guys. I remember. So this is your new best friend, Mr. Cauliflower, and blah. <laughs> I, I don't know why it makes that sound. I don't know if I like this or not. This is another one of those. This slightly makes me feel uncomfortable. So it's a series of vegetables that stick their tongues out. I saw you guys requesting the weird gotchas. Which reminds me, if you do want to request gotchas and themes and stuff, you can always leave them down in the comments. I try to read and to reply to as many as I can, but I'm also on Twitter, Instagram, and Facebook where I love chatting with you guys. So follow me there, tell me about your day, and we can talk about weird gotchas. Here is Pikachu with some tulips, and Pikachu looks absolutely blissful here. He looks very serene, and he's, he's at peace. He's found his inner peace. Nah. Well, that went well. I think this is maybe the final cap breakfast one. I don't know, let's open it up. I think this is the burger one, my favorite. Here we go guys, time to build a burger. Here we have the bottom bun, which is textured and shaded perfectly. I mean, I know it's a mold, but still. A cat burger patty, some lettuce. Why don't we go ahead and put some ketchup on? That's cute. And then the top bun has a cat face. Of course, you know, you always eat your burger with a knife and fork. There we go. Let's open this up. We're, we're getting to the end, guys. Now I'm getting kind of sad. It's a toilet. And it opens, oop, it opens up. It was not supposed to fall apart like that. There we go. Hold on, little toilet. And we have a happy brown poo. Oh, Jigglypuff. Jigglypuff with a flower crown. This is from the flower series as well. Let's open this one. Oh, another Halloween one. I wonder if this is from last year. Pikachu in a pumpkin. This is adorable. I always forget to pull these guys out, like all my seasonal stuff to take cute photos. Let's see, guys. Well, the gotchas I'm gonna do at the very end. I'm gonna build them and then we'll end on that. It's Minnie, I forgot we hadn't opened Minnie yet. That means we still have another one out there, I think. There is Minnie, oh, she's really cute. Let's see, how about we open this one? I think it's another Pokemon. Pikachu! There's a Pikachu, oh, Pikachu, please stand up. Please tell me you can stand up, there we go. There is Pikachu. Another Pokemon one. This must have been a full set too. It's Gengar. I think I have a set of these in like Disney characters with like pumpkin butts. What is this? What? It looks like a cake stand. I don't remember getting this one either. It's really cute. So we have the little purple plate. First of all, the color scheme is me. And then a blueberry tart that is shaped like a bunny. And then we have the lid, which has a bunny on it. Let's open this guy up. Bulbasaur! My only issue with these is they're coming out really smudged, which does not make me happy. Wow, I really can't believe we've made it this far. Here is one that I got recently. Bunny Cosmetics. 
Oh wow, this is like actual packaging. Like this is cardboard in the back and this is just thin plastic. I thought it was a figure that looked like packaging, but this actually comes out of the packaging. Oh, it's a ticker butt. You know what, we haven't had this time? That seems a little weird, his head. <laughs> I feel like it doesn't quite fit on his body, and I don't know. But this is a, I don't think it's a magnet, I think it's just like a sticky piece here. You can put it on the wall, hang your keys or something on there. But you know what we haven't had this video? We haven't had any animal butts. That was a huge theme last time, do you guys remember that? Pig butts and hedgehog butts? I feel like that was a thing too. More poop though, poop's a big theme this time. Here we have a little squatty potty, or kitty potty, and... A little happy pink poo that doesn't quite fit. There we go. Let's open this guy up. Oh, Mimikyu. When they first announced Mimikyu, I fell in love. The background story, the design, I just, I just I, Mimikyu's so cute and Mimikyu has a smudge too. I don't like that. Let's open this one. I think this is Mickey from the figure collection, the Kore Kara. There we go. Ta-da! Here's Mickey. And here's Minnie. Oh, they look so cute together. Did not think we would make it this far. I was I was losing hope there. And Bulbasaur. So I must have gotten a full set. So a full set of these guys and doubles of Pikachu apparently. These are actually really nice clips. I think a lot of these last ones are Pokemon. Here we have Squirtle. I remember the last video, the theme was very much Yokai Watch, but this time the main theme is Pokemon. I love the coloring on these figures, very pastel and cute. Doo -doo. Orange poop and a toilet brush. Orange poop is happy, so it's just silver and gold poop that are unhappy. Is that a life lesson? All the silver and gold won't make you happy? Oh, look at speaking of Mimikyu, this is just from a set of Mimikyu figures. Look at his little eyes. And his hand. Oh, random Hello Kitty. Sleeping Hello Kitty mascot. I think it's just like a little figure. It's kind of like a Tsum Tsum. Three more to open and then just the gotchas to go. Who is this? Oh, I know the name of this character. Oh, why can't I think of it? Shaman? Watch me be totally wrong, but I think that's what the name was. Just, you know, basking in the sun, enjoying the flowers. One more acrylic charm. I thought we opened all the Kingdom Hearts ones. Is this something else? Oh no, it's Kingdom Hearts. It's the Atlantica set. I love Goofy as a turtle. I think it's the cutest design ever. Last little gotcha. Can you believe it, guys? It is a final Pochaco. Oh, this one may be the cutest one yet. And I only say that because Pochaco is holding ice cream. Wait, does Pochaco balance on one foot? Pochaco, you can do it. Oh, he's walking with his ice cream. Okay, guys, the last two. So I have two miniature gachas here. I'm gonna put them together. I'll see you at the end. And wow, we made it, guys. And here it is, guys, the two final gotchas. One was a Minions-themed one, which is pretty cute. And one was from Toy Story 4, which um, I don't know what is who this character is. It's called Gabby Gabby. There was a Bo Peep one, Woody, Buzz, Forky. I pretty much would have loved to have any other one. <laughs> but maybe Gabby Gabby is a really fun character, and I will love her once the movie comes out. Fun fact, my grandpa used to call me Gabby Gabby because I talk so much. Anyway, those are the gotchas. Here is a final look at everything I opened up today. I almost filled a whole case. 100 gotchas is really a lot. I really didn't expect it to take me hours to film this video. I'll never say no to opening gotchas. I hope you guys enjoyed. Give this video a like. Let me know in the comments down below which gotcha was your favorite. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye!